First thing I need is I need the Snack Tech Color Observer, I need the Snack Tech Director Plus, and an ESP8266. Now, I've already connected the director as it's mentioned in the example code. So I'll just plug that in. And then we go over to the example code. And we're gonna plug in the director. And of course we get our drive. So click on script.py and we're gonna paste. So now we're gonna log into the thing speak. You should sign up or sign in. I'm not, I'm now I'm gonna get my API key and I'm gonna paste it in. This is my Wi-Fi network here. And if we look at the code, the first thing we do is we open a UART connection to the ESP8266. Then we tell it to disconnect from the Wi-Fi, configure the mode, reconnect to the Wi-Fi with the SSID and password. Then we wait until we get a proper IP from the network before we can continue. Then we configure the ESP for multiple TCP connections. We open a TCP connection to the ThingSpeed IP on port 80 and on channel 3. And then here is the sample data that's going to be sent. The data here is put into the API call string and then the string is sent over the Wi-Fi network to the ThingSpeed server over here. This is setting up the, the send and it's adding the length of data to be sent and then here the data is actually being sent. Then we turn off the blue LD to show the sending has finished and this part here simply checks to see that the send actually succeeded and if it didn't a red LED comes on, if it did the green LED comes on. So you can right away tell if it's working without having the director plugged in the computer. Now we have an example code to use with our script. So the first part we need is this part. We need to initialize the color observer object. So we'll do that maybe over here. We want to do a color reading just before we send. So that would be that would be in here somewhere, right before the sample data. So we'll do a color reading, and then these uh, this list here we can simply we'll just call the color sample C, and then these can be C, and uh, then we save. Got my IP address. And we have a send. And you should see that show up here. We have our first data point. What we should also do is print out the values that we're getting. So we'll copy that over here. And then we'll paste it. Save the script. Reset the director. And we should see do the mistake, okay. reset the director, save the script, yeah, we can see our sensor, sensor saturating. So we're going to pass some parameters to lower the gain on the sensor. What we'll do is we'll, right now the, the default gain is 16 times with an integration time of 24 milliseconds. We should first try to reduce the gain, so we'll, we'll say um, that gain is equal to and then there's a macro that we're going to do one time game. So, save that and reset the director. We got IP address. And you can see we're now not saturating on the colors, but we're still saturating on the clear. So, what we'll have to do is we'll reduce the integration time. So, go over here and type in 
and then how about right now it's at 24 milliseconds well the next the, the next setting is 2 milliseconds so we'll try that